Hi there, my name is Darren Spoo. I'm the pastor here at First Baptist Church in Tulsa. And several years ago, I walked off of this platform after a Sunday morning of teaching and preaching. And I met a woman right here. She met me at the bottom of the stage. And it was her first time in church. Not her first time in my church. This was her first time in church in her entire life. She looked to be in her mid-20s. And she asked me one question. She said, is there a book that you guys read that can let me know what you believe? Is there a book you Christians read that can help me understand what you think about God? Now, I know the right answer. I just wasn't sure the right answer was the best answer. The right answer is the Bible, but the Bible is so immense. How can the Bible be more approachable? So that is what gave birth, that conversation gave birth to an idea of taking, selecting 40 chapters from the Bible, 20 from the Older Testament, 20 from the New Testament, as a means for people to step in for the first time into reading the scripture. So as a pastor, and I look at myself primarily as a pastor, I see this tool of the good book as meeting a couple of needs. First of all, for those first time readers, it's a place to begin. It develops from the get go a strong habit of Bible reading that each chapter is understandable, each chapter is a little bit self-contained, and gives a different part of the big picture of scripture. But I also see this as a great tool for those who are longtime followers of Jesus. One of my great disappointments as a pastor is seeing people who have sat in this auditorium for years, but on a weekly, daily basis, don't read their Bibles at all. If given the right tools and if given the right motivation, they may step in and begin reading and rediscovering the love of God. Most of all, I believe that there is no single factor that is more pivotal to spiritual growth than is reading the scripture. Prayer is right up there with it. Those two together are most important. More than any programs or any special emphases we can have as a church, simply reading the scripture will spark spiritual growth in my people and in your people as well.